Races for the 2024 election are already heating up. 12 News' Mallory Anderson joins us live in the newsroom with the latest Wisconsin politician to announce a run for re-election. Deanna, this morning, Wisconsin Senator Tammy Baldwin announced she is seeking a third term in Washington. The 60-year-old Democrat said in a statement she intends to continue fighting for the working class and families struggling with inflation, as well as opposing Wisconsin's abortion ban. She also pointed out, as a swing state, maintaining a Democratic Senate majority could come down to Wisconsin. Last week, political director Matt Smith pushed Baldwin on whether or not she'd run again after the Supreme Court race results. But there's a lot of tea leaves being discussed about what this means for 2024, just, just a year ahead. Are you going to run for re-election? I will have an announcement in the very uh, uh, short few, er, I will have an announcement next week. Uh, and, um, uh, you know, obviously with the excitement of this race and the momentum from uh, last Tuesday's race, um, it shows that there's a lot more work to be done. No. Can we assume that's a yes? I can, t I, can I will be having an announcement coming up. <laughs> I'm not going to make it right here, right now. Now that big announcement officially coming today. Also on Upfront, Charles Franklin, director of the Marquette Law School poll, discussed his ex expectations for 2024 elections, including Baldwin's race. Uh, what we saw Tammy Baldwin do in her previous race was make similar kinds of inroads, winning in the Bow counties, winning in the West, taking some of those more rural, central, and northern Wisconsin counties. Open question is, can she do that again? So far, no Republicans have announced that they are running for Baldwin's seat. Last time she was up for re-election was in 2018. Baldwin won that race by 11 percentage points. And that news coming into our newsroom, Mallory, earlier this morning. Now, the Republican Party of Wisconsin issued a statement saying, quote, the Biden-Baldwin ticket will be on the hot seat with Wisconsin voters in a state where four of the last six presidential elections were decided by less than 1% and Biden's approval ratings are upside down.